Hi everybody. Well, this is my tomatoes and my beans. Isn't that pretty? So what I'm doing here is I'm making some fagiolini uh, with tomatoes. And basically what I'm doing is I'm cooking these beautiful fagiolinis from the backyard. They're actually organic. And so are the tomatoes. And I put them in a little bit of water. So what I did is I took my fagiolini, I cut off both ends, and I put it right in here. If you can see there, I just put it on, I have a little bit of water. You see? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut this up and put it on top. And then I'm going to show you. Mm-mm, I can't wait to have this. Yum, yum. There you go. I figured out how to use that pause button. <laughs> so what I did is I chopped up those tomatoes and I put it right on top of the beautiful green beans or fagiolini as they're said in Italian. And basically I put it on top and mmm, smells so good. Look. So, I have three ingredients, fagiolini, water, and tomatoes right now. Okay, I'm going to basically let that cook for a few minutes until they're tender. And after they're cooked, I'm going to put the oil and the salt. I don't put the salt now, but what I can put right now is some garlic, which I'm going to put. And then let that uh, mix in nice and well. Look at it. Mmm. I'm going to put the cover on and put it on medium to low. And I'll catch you back in a bit. So now you can see that I put the garlic on top. And with this garlic, usually the way we like the garlic is sliced garlic. Look how pretty it looks in there. Look at yum. So soon I'm going to stir it and I'm going to get uh, another pot boiling for my uh, pasta. I think uh, what I have here today is some spaghettini. And I'm going to mix that with this for a delicious, yum, good, healthy meal. Mmm. So what I did is I basically put the pot of water on. And I stirred the fagiolinis with le pomodori, or i pomodori, <laughs> fagiolini, beans and tomatoes. And I'm going to add a little bit of salt and a little bit of oil. Now the salt that I use, uh, I like to use uh, an Italian Mediterranean salt. I just love that salt and that's what I use. And then I'm going to have a little bit of olive oil. I'm going to put that in. Mmm, not too much salt. I think this salt is maybe a little saltier. Mmm, mannaggia. There, a little saltier than regular salt. I'm not too sure why, but that's the way it is. And I'm going to add some oil at the end. Mmm, there we go. Oops. And I'm going to stir that up a bit. Well, that's it. That is the secret ingredient to make this yummy, yummy, delicious food. Ah, uh, this camera should have like a smell of vision. It should be like smell of vision instead of television. But it's not television, but it's like YouTube, but I don't know. This is so, so, so yummy. And this is going to taste so good. Actually, I'm going to have a piece right now. Oh, look at it. Look at the juice. Now, I'm going to show you. Mmm. Now, that tastes so good. Mmm. Mmm. 
it has to cook for a few more minutes, maybe about 10 more minutes, and then it's ready. So by the time the pasta is ready, this is ready, I'm going to mix it together, and it's going to go um, in there and into my stomach. Yum, yum. I can't wait. <laughs> So one of my favorite types of pasta to use is the Barilla Spaghettini. It's a very, very thin type of pasta and I'm going to put some into my water and uh, start getting it ready. So what I did is I, I oopsie, I'm boiling some water and I'm going to put the pasta in. There you go. There it goes. Okay, now we're going to wait for a few minutes, add some salt, and mix these two precious things. Look at it together. So now what I did is I strained the pasta, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to scoop up this beautiful... Fagiolini beans. Mm. Stir it up and put it on my plate. This is so yummy, dummy. Yummy, not yummy, dummy. Yummy. <laughs> Holy. Look at this plate. It's massive. I'm going to turn it around. I'm going to put this on pause and make it look nice. One moment. So, here you go here. Here's my beautiful plate of pasta fagiolini. Now, this is one of my favorite, favorite all-time dishes. There. Let me show you how to do this. You get a little bit of this. Now you're supposed to add a little bit of basil and onion, but unfortunately I didn't have those ingredients. I'll add one of these. Mmm. Mmm. That's so perfect. Mmm. The pasta is cooked al dente, the way it's supposed to be. And in here you have your carbs and your vegetables all in one plate. Isn't this great? I give this, hold on, a one and a two thumbs up. Yum, yum. I'd like to thank everybody for watching this video. Saluti e bacioni di Patrizia. Mwah. Ciao e ci vediamo a presto. Ciao.